hi everyone i know it's been a long time since i've done a makeup video but i am back and i'm bringing in new products really excited to be trying them out first time on camera some of them i got from the us some of them are local so i just want to see how they test out and how they look on the face so let's just get into the video To prime the skin, I'm going to be using my setting spray. This is my Prep and Prime Fix Plus in Lavender. Just going to pat it in. Obviously, I have been using this for a while, but it's new. It's sort of new. So I just want that to settle in to prepare for our foundation. But first, we are going to do our eyebrows. I'm using my Wet n Wild Eyebrow Pencil. And what I love about it, it has a spoolie on the one end, so you can just comb through your brow hairs. So I'm going to create strokes first. So I actually went to go through it, so my eyebrows are shaped quite nicely so it makes the job that much easier so you don't want to go too dark in the front and just follow the shape of your eyebrow you can see the direction in which your hairs are going so just create hairs in that direction Now to my favorite part of this tutorial which is the foundation people have been raving about it and I know a girl who has been using it and her skin just looks flawless it looks like her own skin I couldn't wait to try this foundation it's the next can't stop won't stop foundation Just gonna apply some setting spray. Just so that it's not too powdery and that it just settles. I also got some new brushes from Real Techniques. So this is the buffer brush, so you use it for your eyeshadow. And then here it's for your for my eyeshadow. I'm gonna be using my Too Faced Chocolate Bon Bon. I think that's what it says. <laughs> this is the packaging. Taking the crease brush and we're gonna start off with a light color. So we're gonna go in with almond truffle.
Next, we're gonna go in with mocha, which is this color right here. And we're still in the crease, so I'm just gonna. Now I'm gonna go in with a deeper color in the outer corner. I'm taking this color right here. So I'm taking my shading brush. It's great to pick up the color. Let's actually spray it with Fix Plus. Woo! Hello. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. Okay. Sure. Okay, no, I changed my mind. I want to do a halo eye because wow, this is stunning. This color is stunning. So we're gonna contour. I'm just gonna take the remainder of my setting powder and just cut my cheek and off. I'm gonna use a bronzer. This is the Makeup Revolution Ultra Sculpt and Contour Kit. So, this is the light and medium. So, it has a bronzer, a blusher, and a highlighter. I'm going to use my shadow brush for my eyeshadow to contour the nose. Now for blush, I'm going to use the e.l.f. e.l.f. palette. And these are the colors and it has a bolt in mirror as well oh it looks stunning so I think I'll go with this one because it looks nice and shimmery oh that looks beautiful 
I've noticed I like my highlighters to have a bit of a glow. Not highlighters, sorry. <laughs> my blush. Just bring it up to the temple as well. And I just mix it in with my contour. I don't put too much, it is very pigmented. You do not want to look like a clown. Unfortunately, this is also not available in South Africa, but there are quite a lot of online stores that do sell these brands. One trusted one is Muse Beauty, so you can check them out. I'm gonna go in with highlighter from this palette. Also bring it to the temple. Gonna snatch the nose. For lashes, I'm going to be using Eyelure. And these are in collaboration with Jasmine. They are in the style JB and they are dramatic. And yes, you can't find these in SA. I'm really sorry, guys. But I love the brand is in South Africa. It's just the, this type of style, you won't get it here. So off camera, I just went in with my mascara from Essence. This is the All Eyes On Me. Finally, for the lips, I'm going in with Maybelline New York. This color is called Orange Danger. Ooh. Bold and it's in the number 6 setting spray just to give you guys some feedback overall I loved every single one of the products I used I can't really pinpoint exactly which one was my favorite but the whole look just really came together I was worried that maybe the eyeshadow won't look good with this lip color but I think it really ties in together really nicely Thank you guys so much for watching. Before I close out today's video, I just have to give a subscriber shout out to Tandom Lambo. Thank you so much for supporting. It's really appreciated. If you haven't subscribed already, you can just hit the button that is red. It says subscribe at the bottom. And while you're at it, click the bell so you're notified every time I post a video, which is every week. It was really fun creating this makeup look for you guys. I hope you enjoyed it as well. May your day be ever flawless as your makeup.